and welcome to Conflict Nerd Plays. This week, Killing Floor. Before we begin, I would like to introduce a very special guest. This week we have Vince with us. I don't think I count as a fucking... As a... Excuse me, I don't think I count as an effing guest. That oh, was kind of... Just, yeah. That, that, that was quite, quite the way to start things. Yes, it was. <laughs> That's fine. The game's 18 yeah. rated or whatever, so I think we can get away with it. Don, you know how many young viewers you have? No, I don't. And they're probably if they're young viewers, they probably shouldn't be watching me. I don't. You shouldn't I don't be watching this fucking show, kids. Yeah, yeah. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. <laughs> Bad time. All right. Uh, killing floor. I love Killing Floor. I, I love Killing Floor as well. Before you go to sleep, clear your internet history. Just just to make sure. Uh, but yes, Killing Floor. Oh god! Killing Floor. Wonderful game. I need a shotgun. The pistol is... The pistol is nice, but it's like candy and liquor. Candy is dandy, but liquor is quicker. And I just did that. You know why? Why? Because fuck you, that's why. Well, I you can't argue with that logic. Yeah. I I'm, I feel weird. I I feel incomplete because I don't have a better gun. I don't want the pistol. I want a chainsaw. <laughs> I want a shotgun. You know. Because shotguns are Gods, gift to man. <laughs> yeah. On the on the seventh day, God. God delivered the twelve gauge. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and he said, "Go forth and do my bidding." <laughs> and there there goes all religious viewers, all one of them. Ah, uh, they'll be fine. Right. You know something? I'm gonna buy a shotgun as well. Cause cause why not? I'm All also right. going to work on my welding stuff in this match a bit. I'm just going to weld random doors as I come across them, so I can't weld that. I don't think this one has that many doors. Here's oh, a door. A wood door. The, I'm going to weld there's a, there's a window right beside it that you can go through. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> what is the point in this? <laughs> Shut up. Look to the right. Dylan. And your left. Dylan. 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 I know what you're... I know that you're trying to be helpful and all, but no, I'm trying to, I'm trying to ding. Okay. How do you weld wooden doors shut? I'm sort of thinking the same thing, if I'm perfectly honest. Wow, oh, shit gets welded up really fast on this difficulty. Maybe it's yes. because they're made of wood and you only have to weld two hinges, not this the entire... Di this yeah. difficulty. This easy. Not even no, easy. No, we're playing on hard. We are it's, playing on the hardest difficulty. Yeah, the hardest difficulty known to man in the history of video games. <laughs> Beginner. <laughs> It's actually a lie on Killing Floor. It's um, actually the hardest difficulty. It's basically to punish people who it's think, ironic. oh, you know, beginner. Yeah. You know, it's all about the irony. It's all it is. They're breaking this door down pretty quickly. How? They had a lot of people on the other side of it. So they did. A lot of them are dead now. Well, that was nasty. At least most of them are dead now. I love shotguns. Yes. Another thing I also love is those little chocolate orange things. Terry's chocolate orange? Yeah. They're so good. I actually saw them in the shop the other day for like, I think it was buy one for three pounds and get two free. That is a fantastic deal. That's I would have bought a good 27. Deal. See, <laughs> see, for the, see, for the last couple of days at college, though, it's been, um, like, what I've been doing, um, on, 
Wednesday, I went down to the store and I bought two six packs of donuts, <laughs> some six custard donuts and six jam donuts, uh, a four donuts. pack, a four pack of Monster Energy drink, and you know I shared this out with a group of people that I was with. We were all oh. kind of going nuts by the end of it, but I'd already had a can of Monster earlier earlier in the day, so all I had eaten in that day was like five donuts and three cans of Monster. <laughs> And then the Perfectly next healthy. the next day, I bought a 12-pack <laughs> of donuts, and someone else bought a 12-pack of donuts, and I bought a six-pack of Red Bull. <laughs> and this has been my lunch for the last couple of days at college. Dylan, I don't even have real food at the house most days. I'm jealous. I, I have actually lost a tremendous amount of weight in these last couple of days, because as it turns out, energy drinks are effectively... you. Bastard. <laughs> Ener energy drinks are effectively, they will make you feel, for fuck's sake. <laughs> you can unweld the doors, don't I'm going round. <laughs> hey, buddy. Hello. Energy drinks make you feel full, basically. And, um, because I've had so many of them. Oh, it's just ridiculous. They're so good, though. I'm, slight, I'm really, seriously, horribly addicted, but I regret nothing currently. He says, as he's being rushed to hospital. <laughs> Having a heart attack. Having a heart attack. Needing yeah, my stomach careful, pumped. Actually, uh, my dad had a had a stroke, so... From too many energy drinks, so... Watch yeah. that shit. How, how he's, many he's was... He's perfectly fine, so... How, how many was he drinking on... The daily basis? He would drink, like, a half a pot... Like, several... Like, three pots of coffee and, like... Seven Red Bulls in a day. Hmm. I I would have uh, the weekends not so much. I had a lot of Red Bull today because I had it left over from Thursday. Um, but I usually would have during on a week's day, say a can of Monster in a day, and that's about it. I need some help over here. Working on it. Work harder. Grenade. You might want to move. I'm fine. You don't tell me what to do. I just did. Yeah, no one tell me what to do. I'm older than you! I can tell you to do whatever the fuck I want. Is that what you say to all... <laughs> is, that, is that what you say to all the women, Vince? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm older than you, so make me a sandwich. Oh, God, there goes all the female... Oh, wait, no, I didn't have any. <laughs> I'm uh... sure the missus watched our videos on occasion. I don't, I think your, your, she's your watched mother? some. I know my mother's watched a couple of them. I don't think she does anymore. <laughs> um, I don't think any of my family actually watch my videos anymore. I don't know why the hell I bought That's that. Sad. It's not, it's good. It means I can say things about them and then I will never know. And then one day they come out and say, I've been watching your videos, Dylan. I'm very disappointed in you. <laughs> oh, God. I can see that happening, actually. What I can actually can just... Uh, I can see, like, a couple of hours after I upload this video, I just get a message from my from uh, my mom on Facebook. I watched it. Don't know what you're talking about. That would be worrying. I know she watched, um... Some of my Guild Wars stuff. To see if the game was any good, if it was worth getting. From what I've heard, if I had an actual decent computer that wasn't shit, I would play the hell out of that game just Guild because Wars. it was free. Guild Wars, no, Guild Wars isn't free. It's not subscription Guild based, Wars if that's what you that's mean. That's what I meant, subscription yeah. based. The Old Republic I'm... has actually gone free to play, but it's such, yeah, it's, a to, bit of a, it's a bit of a dodgy free to play model. Um, no, what was, what was I going to say? Yeah, Guild Wars is good if you have a friend to play it with, which is kind of my downfall because I had no one to actually play the sorting game with. Uh, if I ever have a decent computer, I'll play with you. Fair enough. If I'm, but I'm probably gonna play the hell out of the Elder Scrolls Online when it releases. So I'll probably if I have a computer, same. because from what I'm seeing, everything actually looks different. Yeah, it does look interesting. Is, like that is the downfall of modern MMOs. They all follow the mo majority all... of them follow the WoW template. Yeah, that's kind of why Planet Side Two is a big thing at the moment. It's a first-person shooter MMO. Uh, it's sodding wonderful.
you know, this this is the kind of average conversation that, you know, one would have while slaughtering zombies. Yeah, very well, casual. Are these things even zombies? Uh, they're, they call them Zeds, so, yeah. I can assume so. Oh, look, fat ones. Don't you just love killing the fat ones, Dylan? Ah. I'm about to lose our overweight viewers. Um, I can't <laughs> stand... Um, at, l I, at least the fat Zeds aren't wearing jaggings. No, I, I have no problem with <laughs> overweight people, but if you are so overweight that three steps absolutely wins you and you are wheezing, you might want to rethink some of your major life decisions. I'm not overweight in that three steps generally wins me. <laughs> it's four steps for you. Yeah. <laughs> no, I, um... At least the, at least the larger variant of zombie isn't wearing skin-tight jeans or something like that. God, that'd be horrible. That's, that's honest. Just, why, why do people do that? It's like, you, you take up what four seats on a bus? If that's not even that's not even possible because you only have two beside each other. But somehow you take up four, you fat bastard, <laughs> and you, you still insist on wearing. We're lovely people. <laughs> you still insist on wearing jeans that make you look like a roast piece of ham that's got the you know the when you put like the string around a piece of meat to cook it. You know the way it bulges Where did out. You it's, go? It's yeah. like that. Uh, you, also, you, don't. I'm gonna legs, heal you. Their Just legs saying. look like that. I'm trying to heal you, not bloody tickle you. Stand Apparently, stand you're trying down. to heal me, not tickle me. <laughs> I heard something about uh, let me heal you, or I'm not trying to stick it where the sun don't shine. So, yes. Yeah, that's what I heard. You know, we've probably lost. Well, we've lost my... Your female uh, viewers, your slightly overweight viewers, your religious viewers, your male viewers, your child viewers, your transvestite viewers. Yeah. Well, at we least I still have... a transvestite fan base still. Yeah, at least I still have my animal demographic. <laughs> you know, all the sheep and the, the barnyard animals that just sit around and watch my channel. Wishing they had thumbs. <laughs> so that they could type up insults. Yeah. So they they I'm wouldn't insult about that joke you made about having sex with my mother. Yeah. The cow. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Oh give me a sec, I'm reloading. Oh that went well. You should probably buy some armor, Dylan. I am fine. I don't believe in armor. It keeps you alive for longer. Jesus will be my shield, Vince. I don't... I... <laughs> You're not sure if you should come back to that one, are you? You're not sure uh, about go about having some smart-ass remark there. <laughs> I don't think Jesus is zombie-proof. <laughs> wait, no. I mean... He, he's a zombie, so I'm not <laughs> sure how that would work. He came back to light. That makes him a zombie. Oh, my God. I'm going to wall this door shut. You, you do that. <laughs> that. We're horrible people. Everybody pray to zombie Jesus. Indeed. He died for your brains. Well... He died for nothing in my case. The Easter Bunny, the reason we celebrate Easter is because the Easter Bunny is actually codenamed for a zombie slayer. So. Fair enough. Uh. It's kind of like the eagle has landed, you know, it's the, the Easter Bunny, basically. <laughs> you know, the, the Easter Bunny... I can afford uh, the Impaler. But actually, mine is I, kind of can, better. I, I so. can also infor afford it. Um, bitty bitty bitty. I kind of want the M32 grenade launcher just because it's awesome. Look at that shit. Well, I, I have a nail gun. Launcher. I I have a nail gun which I'm fine with. Stay put while I heal you. You repair my armor. Bitty bitty bitty. Stand still. Do I look like I'm gonna buy armor? Actually, that's what I'm missing. 
yeah, I just told you to buy armor, and you're like, nah. Yep. Nah, I don't need no armor. I'm fine. Actually, the quote was that Jesus is my armor.